I'm Blake Strobel for Spex Howard School of Media Arts. We're here at Sarah Chevrolet in Southfield to see what certain car companies are doing in response to higher gas prices. We're going to talk to some of the dealership managers today to also see what they have to say. So let's go take a look. Things have changed because of gas prices. Right now, cu customers are going to smaller vehicles based on gas. That's what they're going into. Right now, GM is responding with uh, cars that are getting flex fuel, cars that are averaging 36 miles to the gallon. So they're definitely answering all the response to uh, people wanting better gas mileage. But again, people are dropping down in size of vehicles because of gas prices. The cruise and the Malibu is definitely uh, coming pretty good. And now they're making SUVs as well as V6 and 4 so. Uh, flex fuel is a corn-based uh, fuel. Um, it's a lot cheaper um, than regular gas, but it does burn a little faster than regular gas. They are coming out with a, a kind of a Volt hatchback kind of in the workings. It's a, a combination of electric charge as well as a gas. Um, that's with the combination of getting close to 47 miles a gallon. The Chevy and the Malibu is probably one of our top selling, both of our top selling cars. And again, they're giving you 36 miles of the gallon on the cruise. Um, which this car is based at 18000 So um, if you go into the electric cars, I would say those will probably price a little higher. But for Chevy, it affects our truck sales. Some of our bigger vehicles like the SUVs, the Tahoes, Silverados, those vehicles are affected definitely by the, the gas prices going up. Today we found out that Chevy is making a valiant effort at making more fuel efficient cars, such as the Chevy Volt and the Chevy Cruze, which is also a flex fuel vehicle. Although gas prices are continuing to rise, there's not much we can do, but luckily car companies are helping us out by making more fuel efficient vehicles. I'm Blake Strobel for Spex Howard School of Media Arts.